This week in the Automotive Trends Garage, we've got the 2012 Toyota Prius V. Now, as you'll recall, we're not exactly huge fans of the Toyota Prius. It's 1.8 liter, four cylinder, paired with the uh, Toyota Synergy Hybrid Drive System, is a bit droning at speed. Um, actually, it's a bit droning anytime it's on. Unfortunately, that engine carries over into this package. Fortunately, they've paired it with a little bit more aggressive final drive. So when you put your foot down, it actually feels like you're doing something, unlike in the Prius. A few more things we're not too fond of. The interior materials feel a little bit low grade for a $36,000 car. Uh, the Prius V5, this is the top of the line model, it has, it's not a, a leather seat, it's more of a synthetic, material, kind of like vinyl, that Toyota has named Softex. Uh, so we're not fond of that. The steering wheel actually uh, seems as though it's gotten its inspiration from a bit of sandpaper. So that's really not uh, pleasing to the touch. And then finally, the instrument cluster layout being up in the center, much like the uh, Prius. Again, it's not where our eyes are used to going. You can get used to it, but it is a bit of a nuisance right off the bat. Some of the things we do like about this is it's longer, wider, and just larger overall. Uh, the package is far more versatile than the original mm, hunchback Prius, if you will, uh, which makes it more acceptable in our eyes. It's just some of the shortcomings of the Prius are m much easier to swallow in this package. So we're on board with that. Another thing we like is that how Toyota has been innovative in keeping the weight down. This thing only adds another 232 pounds over that of the regular Prius. And one of the, benef one of the ways they did it here was, see this moonroof? It's not your traditional glass moonroof. It's a polycarbonate material. Interesting. And finally, being that this is a Prius, they have kept their focus on actual fuel efficiency. City 44, Highway 40, overall combined 42. Very respectable for this size vehicle and how much larger they've made it, especially on the inside. So, are we fans of the Prius now? No, but this is far more acceptable and we like where this is going. 